Yes then guys, how are you doing? My name is Morsi and welcome back to a brand new player view on my channel. We've got the new team of the week, it is here and it is by far the most insane looking team of the week we've had so far in FIFA 22. And one of the best looking cards out of that team of the week is Mr. Silence, the haters, Memphis the Pie. So here is Memphis in all of his glory, 115,000 coins I spent on this chap. Is he worth it? It's only a plus one upgrade, of course being an international team of the week, previous FIFAs they don't get dynamic images. We're yet to see if EA are going to change their mind this time round. But yeah, this is pretty much the card you're going to get for 115k. He does also have that one to watch. But 5 foot 9 high low work rates, right footed with the 5 star skills and freestyle weak foot. Now the attributes. He has really well rounded stats. Pretty much every single stat minus defending is in that like low to high 80 bracket. We've given him a hunter. I really want to boost the pace. We go up to 90 acceleration and I believe that's 92 sprint speed. Also the nice little shooting boost. I'm hoping this man's going to be clinical. And fingers crossed the freestyle weak foot doesn't let him down too much. Passing is fantastic. The link up play, the, even the free kicks. You're not going to have a single issue with that. Dribbling, agility and balance, 81, 82. Reactions, 84. This year around, you probably noticed that agility and balance isn't necessarily as important as last year. So fingers crossed he doesn't feel too clunky on the ball. He also has a decent bit of strength, decent physical stats across the card. And in regards to the trace, we've got a whole handful. Flair, outside the foot shot and a couple of CPU AI traits. So the card looks really solid. I've got high hopes, but let's see if he's worth that 115k price tag. So these are the boys that we're going to be using in today's player view for the pie. We've got Dembele, Vinny Jr. I don't know how anyone gets on with this card. I cannot stand it. He is the most unreliable player in front of goal. Dribbling, he doesn't even feel that agile on the ball. Hopefully, now that I said that, this man's listening and he's going to sort himself out for this player view. In the midfield, we've got Valverde, we've got Griezmann and we've got the budget Vieira himself this man i got him in my red player pick and he is cracked out guys super cheap card he's gone up a little bit to about that 15 to 20k price bracket he was this guy at one point and he is such a baller the sweaty bat four we got Afonso Davies, Upa Meccano, Lacroix, Ebabu and Neuer in goal in regards to the custom tactics guys we're going to rock the 4-3-2-1 it is as balanced as it gets forward runs is pretty much all we're tweaking in this 50-50 Formation itself is a 4-3-2-1. I'm going to mix it up a little bit. Griezmann's going down into the uh, midfield here. And he's going to swap places with Valverde. So Depay is going to be our striker. That is where we're going to try him out. Vinny Jr. and Dembele either side of him. Griezmann, Valverde and Vieira in the middle of the park. And then the back four stays the same. So we are currently sat in Division 2. And I'm pushing towards Div 2 Rank 1. It is sweat central. I'm not playing too many Division games at the moment. I smashed down my foot champs qualifications. We are in that. But champs uh, finals, whatever it's called, on the weekend, we're ready to go. But let's see if the pie is worth the hype, worth the money. Is the upgrade good enough? Does it justify the price tag? Let's see. What is my opponent rocking? That is a ridiculous team. Mbappe, Robbie Keane, De Bruyne. Div 2 up is absolutely disgusting. And this opponent is going to be sweaty, you already know it, guys. But we're here to test out the pie. Fingers crossed we can give a decent review on the man. And I don't just get absolutely run over by my opponent. Oh, the pipe. I don't know how we pulled that off. We got super jammy with a little double-A ball in, but the pie gets his debut goal 18 minutes in. It's probably about his second touch of the ball. Valverde created the run. Vinny Jr. actually picked him out. All right, so shit talk your players, guys, and they might step up in game. That is what I'm learning here. But the pie gets the goal. It was about a two-yard tapping. Oh, well done. The pie leading that charge. All right, first real takedown of the ball. How does he feel? Feels good. Close control dribbling's lovely. Picks out a pass nice. You'd expect him to be a fantastic link-up player. That's the one thing you're going to notice with the stats. And that's what you should expect. It's going to be... Oh, I'll tell you what, hold up. Let me just focus up here. Get him on the ball, little rainbow. Oh, we've done him. We've done him. Decent effort. Yeah, you don't feel too quick on the ball. It's one thing you notice almost instantly. But he's got the strength and power. I feel like he's going to be a bit of a bruiser. A bit like Tevez. Go on there, Belly. Use that pace. Lovely. Pick Grease out. Valverde is charging. The man's on a mission. Come on. Vinny. Back to Depay. Keep that close control. You... All right. Man's got to be scoring there. we got to be at least hitting the target there. I may have rushed it a little bit. I've got to stuck under my feet. We sold him a dream with the close control right bumper dribbling, though. Oh, it's a great bit of play. Keane gets the goal. Fair play. Decent bit of effort. This man looks like a fantastic striker this year, to be fair. Did me with the old fake shot in behind. 
We're gonna regret that Mr. Memphis chance. Come on, Memphis, make up for it, lad. So one all at half time. The Pies had his chance, he scored a two yard tap in but he had a decent opportunity to bag his second. But that's fine, all we need is one more chance for the boy and I'm confident he's gonna find the back of the net. My opponent's decent, his team's ridiculous. Well done boys, good bit of press. All right Vinny, turn it up a bit are ya? Little counter-attack action. Grease into the pie, you want him driving here. Lovely control, unreal save from Lopez, back in. Boys, what are you at, Griezmann? Unfortunate, but this man's control feels great. He got the flair, he got the skill moves, he's gonna take nice turns, left, uh, left stick dribbling is gonna be decent with the card. Sterling and Diaz coming on, Vinny Jr. and then Bele to the bench. We need a little bit more reassurance up front. The Depay is the perfect link-up man though. You're gonna notice the pace being a bit of an issue. Like if you especially got forward runs and getting behind on Depay, he's not very quick. You're gonna notice that. He's gonna get bullied by defenders, especially the amount of overpowered centre-backs this year, like LaCroix, St. Just, they're gonna bully him. But use him as the link-up play, trigger the runs with the left bumper, and I'm having a bit of fun with it. We still need that goal. I want a W. Let's see if we can pull it off. Lovely. The pie through the middle. Get that, the pie. Go on. Battle. The strength, lovely. Get Sterling involved. Utilize that pace. Back across the pie! I don't know how he's not got the end of it. That should have been it, boys. That should have been it. Oh, just like that. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. This one hurts. <laughs> that hits me deep. I don't know how we didn't score a minute ago. And my opponent gets the old sweaty cut back of Mbappe, and we're 2-1 down. We go again, we want revenge. Please, not somebody who's going to pass around the back. We're up against another key. Another hero key. Not like one was enough in the first game, we'll go back to back. But come on, Memphis, step up in this one, my son. I need something extra from you. Pie through the middle. Decent control. Oh, the control this man has is fantastic. Finesse shot not quite on that level, but the first touch is brilliant. Oh, it's a brilliant bit of run. Memphis, there it is. The finesse. That is what I'm talking about. His movement off the ball is seriously solid. You notice him creating them runs in behind. There might be the forward run tactic playing, uh, playing its part there. But overall, no complaints so far. And there we go. Just like that. It's Keane again. No, he's done it again. Oh, that's ridiculous movement. What a goal! Greasy Grease steps up when needed. Another finesse shot were added to the list. But the close control dribbling. Oh, beauty. Oh, no. Not again. Keen, not again. Keeper. Noya, you beast. Love that. Annihilate him. Is there any way to stop that man from getting on a goal? Come on, Avini. Fancy turning up for the boys. One more attack in this half. Can we make it count? The pie. That running behind, the forward run is amazing. What a ping, Memphis. Do the keeper. Yes, there he is. That goal was beautiful. Brilliant pick out, I believe, of Vinny Junior. The forward running behind for Depay, great touch. Had the strength to hold of the defender. Beats the keeper and bags it. Just like that, the comeback is there. 3-2. Can I hold on for a W? Come on, Diaz, get lucky. Depay! Always that one more defender. There's always one more, boys. No matter how many you take on, get past, one is always lurking. Come on up, boys. There's nine minutes to go. Can we hang on? Can we pull off a big upset? Can we put Keane in the mud? Keane, Mane, Sal uh, Salah, all in the mud, boys. We could do this. Just got to believe. A double roulette. Big block. Win that, though. Sterling! Sterling! Sterling? <laughs> no? Is that it, though? 3-2. We get the W. I don't know what happens in the majority of these games. It is seriously questionable, the amount of randomness that happens. Uh, but we take the W, Depay gets himself two lovely goals. Well deserved, this time we had the possession. I'll take it. But is our man Memphis Depay worth the 115K? He's a fantastic card. I've used his 85 a couple of times in draft. 
and he plays somewhat similar. The upgrade is not ridiculous, it's pretty consistent across the card. The pace, you will notice him getting caught a few times, but if you've got forward runs on, he makes fantastic off the ball runs. That is one thing I noticed straight away. Creating space, cutting in behind the defenders, and he is an ideal pick out man. His first touch is sublime, the man takes the ball, it's like a pillow. He cushions it down, takes it down, close control dribbling, right bumper dribbling, all of that is fantastic with the card. Passing, didn't have a single issue. Shooting, he scored a couple of decent efforts, good finesse goal in that second game. But there were a couple of opportunities where he kind of missed his dinner, but that's fine. A more, more consistency with the cards you will get, the more informs he gets. But is he worth the price, guys? I probably wouldn't go out and spend 115k on this card. At the time of recording, I picked up about an hour ago. So he's sitting about the 100k price uh, range as it stands. It's probably fair. At the start of the game, I need to be a bit more respectable. 86 overall inform the pie. Play him as an out-and-out -out striker. I reckon he's probably better suited as a cam or potentially a second-man striker to use to link up the play a little bit. On the edge of the box is where he's going to be sensational. I feel like if you like your skill moves and you're fantastic at dribbling on this game, then the pie is a fantastic shout for you. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this as always. If you did, please drop me a like, subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you very soon for another video. Take it easy.